Time flies when you're not flying, and I was shocked to realize that it had been seven weeks since the last time I got into an airplane. And it is so important to get up with a flight instructor every so often to keep your basic maneuvers sharp. And legally, you have to do that, and it's called a flight review. So I rented a 152 and got an instructor and went at it. You need to stay current with slow flight, stalls, steep turns, holding altitude while you're in steep turns, and just refining those basic maneuvers that we all did when we were going through our private pilot's training. And if you don't go flying for a while, you'll lose these skills quickly as I found out. So if you're looking for a good flight instructor for a flight review or a, even to get your private pilot certificate and you're in the Central Florida, Zephyr Hills, Tampa, St. Pete area, this guy's name is Dave Lyons and he is pretty good and he will keep you sharp. Dave was excellent in reviewing these basic maneuvers with me as well as putting me through my paces and throwing a few surprises my way. All right, one more time, simulated engine failure. All right, simulated engine failure. All right, and this is gonna be tight. Uh, we're going right between those trees right there. All right, okay. Sounds good. All right. What? But good, you stuck to your board plan, which was yep. basically taking whatever is right in front of us. The only other thing I think we could have done was tried to make a hard turn into the field Ooh, just off to our right. I thought about it and I'm like, because we were only doing about 65. Yeah. You know, so I'm like, I, I, I checked the airspeed, I looked at it, I'm like, nope, that's that's not. Good. That was good. That was, as an instructor, that was excellent because I was like, when you did that, I was like, okay, holy shit. That's exactly what, <laughs> that's exactly what went through my head. Holy shit. All right, engines are gone. <laughs> Let's not push it. Let's do a power off 180. I'll I'll call the mark. Sounds good. Yeah, I gotta remember this is normal pattern. Yeah. All right. So I will go ahead and cut the power now since we're a little high. Yep. Okay. Make sure it's full rich and Zephyrils 49 or 142 simulated engine out runway five Zephyrils. And you said thousand foot markers or number five thousand foot markers. Okay. So best glide is 60. Yeah, I know, but I'm. I'm hot dogging it. So is that real traffic checking on a tango off uh, left downwind runway five. Arriving traffic in flight. So real. And four nine one four two is short final for five. Gonna be a stop and go. So for else. I'm just pulling back on the throttle there. Okay. Come on, come on. Oh man, oh lord. Oh, so close, but yet not. <laughs> <laughs> All right, bring it to a full stop? Yeah. And we're going to do the soft field takeoff All right. now. All right, soft field takeoff. All right, so 10 degrees of flaps. Full Mitchell, full list. And ready? Yep. All right, full I hear you, Jim. And we're going to pop off just about 55. All is well. I'm near finish, though. All right, 44. 50. 50. Bye. 55. All right. In the ground effect. Effect. Checking everything off of left base from my fives. The real. In the ground effect, 67. We're going to climb out and positive rate of climb and flaps up incrementally very slowly at 72 and flaps up positive rate of climb. And that was your soft field. Good. All right. So we got a thousand feet. Let's power off here. This is pushing it and we'll do the thousand foot markers. And Zephyr Hills, Cessna 49142 is a uh, short approach to runway five, Zephyr Hills. Now I'm high, so I'm just gonna...
and he certainly wasn't shy about correcting me when I did things my way. Come back on the speed. You're overspeeding your flaps. Oh, nope. oh, nope. thanks. All right, we're All gonna right, report this around. Yep. All right, this time you're gonna do it like I tell you to do it. You're gonna maintain 60 knots, and you're just gonna look out the window at your landing point. Right. You slow her down to 16. Glider above, no factor. Where? 500 feet above. Oh, where's he going? He's entering the downwind for one yeah. niner. There you go, this is gonna look a little better. I already see you're a little bit high and fast, so come in just with the rest of your flaps. That's going to help you slow down. Yep. And in this turn, you're probably going to lose most of the altitude that you need to. There you are, you're at 70 knots. Alright, and... May have just come in a little effect. too short. Nope, and never no, mind, you I actually, you're going to float. I might got it, I might got it, I might, might have, have it, it this time. Right on the edge of it. <laughs> that was good. That was like my commercial check ride. <laughs> right on the edge. <laughs>